Infrared Image Processing with GIMP. Here I will show you how to process infrared images with GIMP, its free software. We will open our image as a layer. GIMP does not understand the raw images, so you need to convert them to JPEG or better TIFF formats. Hit Ctrl plus Shift plus J to fill the working screen with the image. Click Colors, Components, Channel Mixer. Set red in red channel to 0, blue in red channel to 1, red in blue channel to 1 and blue in blue channel to 0. Click OK. Click Colors, Levels, drag those two markers closer to the curve. This will make the image look better. If those markers are close to the curve, you may just leave it as it is. Go to Color, Color Balance. Now, slide blue slider to the right to about 20. Do this for shadows, midtones, and highlights. This is probably a bit confusing at first, but this is how GIMP handles color balance. Make the sky look blue or the leaves look white. The green color also may be adjusted very slightly. Usually the red color does not need adjusting. Sometimes you may need to decrease the red color. As said, this rarely needed. Go to Color, Saturation, and increase the saturation slightly until the sky has a proper color. Go to Colors, Curves, and make very tiny adjustments to the curve. The stretched S curve will give a cinematic look. If you do not want to do that, just skip this step. Go to Tools, Transform Tools, Perspective. Usually the photo has a perspective distortion, which is mostly noticeable in a picture from a zoom lens. If you have a prime lens, you may skip this step. Grab each top corner of the picture and pull it to the slides. You will notice how vertical lines are improving. This is basically it. A touch of contrast or sharpness can be added depending how the image looks.